Have you guys ever seen a tsunami? Hopefully not. Today, we're gonna be finding out how big tsunamis can actually get. Tsunamis are some of the most powerful and deadliest forces of nature. Within recent memory, you may recall both the 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami and 2011 Japan tsunami, mm -hmm. both of which resulted in catastrophic damage and loss of life. The Indian Ocean tsunami happened after a massive earthquake struck here in the Indian Ocean. The earthquake itself released more energy than every single explosive detonated in the entire Wait, second what? floor, what? including the no way. Wow. This enormous oh, wow. amount of energy created a tsunami that reached heights of 30 meters feet? high in some places, or about the height of 17 people oh stacking on top of each other. The wave smashed into Indonesia, South Asia, and the east coast of Africa, punching as deep as two kilometers inland from the coast in some places. Actually? As you can see from photos like this one, the damage Ooh. in these places was often extensive. Dude, that just makes me like not want to live near a beach. Yeah. Any single Hopefully time I see pictures insurance. like that, like I just don't want to be anywhere near the water because of how scary it is. I hope they had home insurance. They're I'm dead, not... Alec. Bro, They're dead. 250,000 no, people no. died, Alec. Just swim. Okay, all right. Just swim. It had what? more explosive power power than Thank a nuclear you, Jack. bomb. It just said that. How Alec, are you able to please. swim away from that? No, you no, no, away from a nuclear bomb? They're saying, they're saying it had like more force. Not yes. that it exploded. However, Tsunamis however, don't explode. I, I did think, I did think when I was younger, like, you know when you're at the beach and you like, you, you see a big wave and you go under the wave? I yeah. thought that maybe you could do that for a tsunami, <laughs> that you could get like under you the can. tsunami. And no, then you can't, bro. It's no, two like, miles like, the, long. It hits the you wave like this. two miles. You can't dive two miles, bro. Just do that. India. It's 100 feet tall of pure force. It's not like a normal wave. It's this just video gets 20,000 likes. Alec will verse a tsunami and see who lives. Yeah. No, I won't. I'm not doing it. Oh, you're <laughs> all tough saying, guy. You're all tough guy. I'll do it. You can breaststroke. You can freestyle. You can butterfly. Just swim. Okay. It's just water. Oh my gosh, this guy. Alec doesn't even tsunami know how to swim, so I don't know what he's history. talking about. While the 2011 Japan tsunami was the costliest in terms of damage, that tsunami was also generated by an earthquake that created waves as high as 40.5 meters, just moly. about five meters shorter than the Statue of Liberty, that came slamming into the Japanese east coast, traveling up to 10 kilometers kilometers inland away from the coast. As wow. you can see from photos like this, Sheesh. that look like something straight Six out of a Hollywood miles. blockbuster with what used to be a road stretching out into the endless ocean, the economic cost to Japan was enormous. An That's estimated horrible. $300 billion, billion in damages was done, wow. more than the entire GDP of South Africa. But wow. these are what are called regular tsunamis. And there is an That's a regular one? Wait, why did they just throw South Africa under the bus like that? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of like a shot at South Africa. What? Well, they were just showing you like how expensive yeah, it is. Yeah, I guess, They're but putting, yeah. they put a sad face next to South Africa. What What's was that? more crazy though is that they're saying this is a regular tsunami, insinuating that there's crazier Wait, tsunamis. Wait, those are just regular ones? That was a regular one. Oh, God. What is like a not regular tsunami? tsunami? So regular ones as tall as the Empire State Building. I mean, what's her? Wait, what? The Statue that, of Liberty. That's the Statue of Liberty. Statue of Liberty. Yeah. <laughs> right. Let's get our facts straight, boys. Sorry. Of gigantic waves that are simply called mega tsunamis. Mega tsunami. Unlike a regular oh, no. tsunami that is created by an earthquake, you know, a mega tsunami is usually created when a massive amount of material suddenly falls into water like an asteroid is that water oh into a yeah huge wave uh, the most tragic okay. and possibly terrible or alec when he has a cannibal glacier diving board was back in 1963 here in italy just 100 kilometers north of venice the italian government and a construction company were building okay. what at the time was going to be the largest dam on earth the only problem was that they were building this dam with a huge water reservoir the size of a large lake right next to one of the most Ooh. unstable mountains on the planet with the mountain fell over up to the completion of the dam there okay. were several minor landslides and other signs that there could be a catastrophe coming, but rather than heed the numerous warning signs, the Italian they kept government building, actually didn't decided they? to sue the few journalists Spaghetti. reporting on the issue oh, for, wow. quote, undermining the social order. The government and company continued to ignore sure all the warning really signs until after. it was obvious that the mountain was actually going to collapse directly into the dam's reservoir. The engineers calculated the landslide that would likely occur, lowered the water in the reservoir to what they believed was a safe level, and then actually stood on top of the dam the night that they expected the landslide Why would they to do occur that? to watch it That's all That's because they down. were so confident. The only problem was, the landslide ended up being over 10 times oh. more powerful than what their calculations had predicted. Why would they wow. stand there at that, that mountain point? Today. It's not worth this it. This right here used it's to be the reservoir, poetic. and all the land that's there now came crashing off the mountain from these areas that are oh now exposed gosh. white rock. 
This tremendous amount of earth and rock fell into the reservoir oh in a my matter gosh. of seconds, completely filled the entire that is reservoir, crazy. and generated a wave 250 <gasps> meters high that no. flew over the top of the dam and into the villages below. No. The wave was almost feet? the same height as the Transamerica building what? in San Francisco for some reference, and caused an impact crater 60 meters deep and 80 meters wide oh when it my slammed gosh. into the ground on the other side of the dam. If you were standing so from that's this a new oh, killer wave. The that one's almost like a man made. Alec, Alec, tell, me to, tell me to swim under that one. Tell me to swim. You see in this picture yeah, bro. Be completely covered by water. This photo was taken in the that. town of Longorone, which before the mega tsunami looked like this, but afterwards looked like this. Completely oh my gosh. gosh. Around 2,000 people lost volcano. their lives in the accident. Literally 2,000 people died. It's not actually the largest mega tsunami Stinking scientists, in man. History. Come on. 2,000 people couldn't swim? have to the go to a mega right. tsunami that happened here in Latuya Bay, Alaska, back in 1958. Oh, here a we go, USA, baby. It caused a massive landslide to occur here at the backside of the bay. The huge amount of land that came crashing into the bay created a titanic wave 525 uh, meters high that slammed into this part no. of the bay. No, 1,700 feet. And smashed into the other side here, causing huge no amounts way. of damage to the rest me? of the bay and destroying millions of trees. The height of this wave was over 100 there meters there? higher oh. than the tip of the Empire no State Building, and just 16 meters short of the recently built One I World can't even Trade Center that. in New York City. But even it's this is tiny than the tallest in building. comparison to some they just said it's tiny. tsunamis. Wait, it's the still tiny? It gets bigger? generated from a landslide yeah. happened around 1.5 Probably the one that died on that one. Hawaii, on the Pacific island of Molokai. So this At one happened 1.5 million years ago. How do they know what happened if there's no video evidence? The northern portion of the volcano collapsed into the ocean and generated a wave 600 meters oh. high, which would have completely yeah, look, this inundated video right here. the entire <laughs> island of Molokai and wreaked wow. havoc on the, the rest of the good. island chain. This wave would have been about the height of no. four. Oh hey, my God! <laughs> no way! Other, but even that pales in comparison to the largest. Well, ever how, how many Alex is that, though? That asteroid! I knew it! Whoa, whoa, whoa! How many whoa. Alex is that? That's like a thousand of me. Please just imagine, Probably. like you're like a like a little dinosaur, and like you just look up. It's <laughs> <laughs> funny. It's funny. It's just a two thousand foot wave coming at you out of nowhere. Like they don't even. <laughs> and and before that happened, you saw a meteor the size of the moon come crashing down. What about, like, all the fish that's inside of oh, the tsunami? Sharknado! Yeah, they're probably just, like, surfing, like, shark tsunami, and then boom! Actually. You think they Sharknado was based on a real event? Well, you gotta think, too, that they're going so fast that if you're, like, a fish inside of that wave going however fast that's going, and then you get slammed into land, yeah. you're probably dead on impact. Unless, no, unless they just, you jump they just out of the swim. water right away. They just Alex, swim. You, you keep saying just swim. Just swimming doesn't save you from a he freaking sounds tsunami. Like, he sounds like he's from Nemo. Just keep swimming. Just keep yeah. swimming. Just keep a swimming. fish doesn't All die in water. Do swim, this swim, guy probably- Yes, they can. No, this guy probably thinks that if an elevator's falling, if you jump at the last second before it hits the ground, then you're good. That is exactly how it works. <laughs> this is this guy's so dumb. We can't trust him. So dumb. <laughs> God. When an airplane's the crashing. Only one here. Airplane Alex is the only one here that graduated just college. just jump. If an airplane's crashing, and you just jump right before it lands. He's you're good. the dumbest guy I've ever heard. <laughs> he thinks the Earth is flat. Uh, how could asteroids be falling if the Earth's flat? Oh, he, no, he, no, he no, believes no, the Earth flat. is flat, dude. No, I don't. No, you can't <laughs> say does. that. He does. All right, let's, let's see what this asteroid's about. Which was caused by I did an call asteroid. the asteroid. About 66 million years ago, the same asteroid that likely killed the dinosaurs also caused possibly the largest mega tsunami Three, in all 4, of feet. history when it I'm gonna crashed into the modern-day Gulf of Mexico. 12,000. The asteroid was 10 kilometers in diameter no. and released an un unbelievable 100 teratons of guys. TNT worth of energy. For comparison, the Tsar Bomba, which is the largest okay. nuclear bomb ever detonated, released only one two millionth of that same amount of energy. Oh my god. Two million Tsar bombs to release this same I mean, amount of energy. I mean, it literally destroyed the entire The unbelievable wave of up to five kilometers Whoa. high that would Okay, we were a little bit off. <laughs> Guys, I think we we're, we're a couple feet off, give or take. Yeah, but how many feet is 3.1 miles? Uh, how many feet I don't know. Mile? I'll look it up. It's 16,000 feet. Oh! I was kind of close. I said 12,000. I said five. No, you said five. After I said four, <laughs> I said 12,000. So, uh, Alec lost. All right. Dates of the uh, yeah, Alec is so dumb. That's higher than the Matterhorn in the Alps by about 500 wow. extra meters. Just in swim. fact, the height is higher than all of the oh. mountains in the entire <laughs> Alpine mountain range. These waves were so that all looks big pretty that flat to me. I don't know about you. That's just unimaginable. Ocean, I can't even picture that. Island of Madagascar would have been so what it is is a lot of water that is high in the air. You got it? I, I get right, it. But yeah, but so I can't. I can't picture I, it. I can't wrap my head around that. It's just that, like how tall. Like it would just at that point, it would just be the sky.
So think of like a wall that's in front of you and then yeah. go water. But there's no wall that that's tall. Like I've never seen a, a wall. It's like I'm looking into okay. space, but there's just- uh, so Alec, there's... Alec, he barely leaves his room. So how can you even imagine that? When I look up, I see a ceiling. There's this thing that is called imagination. You can imagine it, right? You but just think of a, a I... big wave of water. I've never seen it before. Oh, so what? But it goes up three miles. If I say I'm unicorn trying, in the I'm sky. Trying. I'm trying. If I say I unicorn look, in the sky. Miles. I need how silence, high guys. I'm trying to focus. You can picture a unicorn in the sky. Okay, I, I see Alec in a tutu. He's dancing. There's there's fairy dust everywhere. And he, he has a horn on his forehead. Adam, okay, Adam. I do okay, have Now do that with water. Whoosh. Now do that with water. Okay, there's a wave Alec. coming. Whoosh. Water, three miles high. Alec just, coming at you. Crashing onto you. In the river. Oh, there's a big wave. Oh my gosh, it's growing. It's growing. It's still growing. It doesn't stop growing. Oh, it's up it's so space. high in the air. Oh my it gosh. So high. Alex eating a cheeseburger on the top of the wave. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can imagine it. Wait, There's, wait, he's he looks like a he's balloon. going in for a, he's going in for a kiss? No? What? Wait, wait what? Wait, what? Are you imagine? Adam's liking it? No. Wait, okay. What? Okay, we're so off topic. No, please. Okay. No. No. Uh, Jack. Gascar in Let's the see scenario what the, how this with finishes. absolutely no escape from the clutches of the ocean's waves, no matter how high on the land that you can get to. It's a weird thought, but at least it happened 66 million years ago, and there's really no fear of something like that ever happening again, right? Wrong. Unless the 0.0001% chance of one of the Canary Islands collapsing into the ocean during your lifetime happens, which would cause a tsunami about one kilometer high oh, and would probably wipe out the entire east coast no. of the United no. States. No, 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 no. Maybe. Wait, 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 wait. Not. Legit, just from an island collapsing, We're on the it east would coast. travel that far? Yeah, it's like a butterfly it effect. Looks, like it with looks the so timey. Dude, that's like, all right, let, let's just kind of take it into perspective here. That's like saying that like one of my turds coming out of my butt is going to cause a tsunami. There's no way. Is that, a, is that a comparison? It's a whole what island. Mean, island. It's a whole island. Than, uh, your poop. How what? Big you poop? I know, it's but a whole compared, island. compared to look how far it has to travel. Look how big the ocean the is. The more time it has, yeah. the bigger the wave yeah, is. The bigger it gets. I've seen poops yes. in the toilet bigger than that little dot on the screen. Yeah, but the longer it travels, the bigger it gets. It's like creating an army of water Jack, as it goes. What is Jack talking about? <laughs> Seriously. Saying, dude, when I poop, there's no tsunami. Me, but you're telling me an island collapsing it is going to cause like a tsunami? It sounds like there might be. We should do some experiments. Sometimes I feel like I say dumb things. That might have been the dumbest thing I've heard today. Yeah. Jack, are you pooping in the ocean? I do have to go to the bathroom. I've pooped in the ocean before, and then I pulled my pants up and went back on the boat, and then it was still in my pants, and it fell down onto the boat. <laughs> no, are you serious? <laughs> yeah, yeah, seriously. <laughs> no, how old were you? Uh, 12, 13. I was, if if that was in the last five, five years, years I would have hung so off. That was, I, I mean, it's, it's, it's basically as good as being in the last five years. So you, like, have a, had a conscience. <laughs> so you weren't, like, three years old. No, no, I, I thought you were gonna say water. you were maybe. I thought you were gonna say maybe you were four years old. I jumped off the boat, pulled oh, my yeah, pants down, old. pooped. You're in middle school. Yeah, that, it's not my <laughs> fault. I jumped in the water, pulled my pants down, you pooped, pulled my it. pants back up, went onto the boat, and the poop was stuck in my pants. You were chum in the water, so you pooped on someone else's boat. No, I pooped in the water, and it got stuck in my <laughs> pants, and then trickled out of my leg onto the boat. <laughs> Sounds like you pooped on somebody's boat. Did you see okay. it, or did it was someone with a couple it was extra boat. steps? It was my dad's boat. Was your dad? You pooped on your father. Boat. He thought it was funny. No. Yeah, it's funny. How did we get from that? Let's talk about tsunamis, okay? Yeah, let's finish. That's your fault. There's no way it gets <laughs> bigger than this. I am very glad but I mentioned it's that. It's still fun to think about. This video has been brought to you by. Oh, oh that him. was the video. That was it. That <laughs> okay, was the whole well. Video. <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. Thank you guys for watching. If you want to check out more Beck Bros, click this video right here. If you poop, leave a like.